Donning a brilliant smile ahead of the first day of school, Cynthia Gadson has been a Hillsborough County teacher for nearly three decades. She says teaching second grade at She High Elementary is a labor of love, but this year comes with changes she's never experienced before. These changes may be necessary, but at the same time, because I'm just finding out about it today as a teacher, I have to go ahead on and be flexible again. This year, every book in Gadsden's classroom library must be scanned and approved. And she's still waiting to learn the complex curriculum the state is requiring for reading. So a training I haven't taken yet that I need to take, and it depends on when they have openings, they're going to offer it to teachers who didn't make it in the summer. In Pinellas County, several high school teachers feeling discouraged after fierce debate over AP psychology and the state's move to ban AP African American studies courses. For many, it means scrapping lesson plans that were months in the making. It is very nerve wracking because I'm going to be going to school on Thursday, not exactly 110% prepared for uh, my three psychology classes. No, I am scared. I'm scared to do anything that's outside of just a basic textbook these days. Teacher shortage is also weighing heavy. Hillsborough County reporting more than 500 vacancies district wide. That means you're going to have double work if you are there, double work, no pay increase. You're not getting paid extra for it. I'm okay with it because I'm a veteran teacher. I'm a soldier.